How are you learners? This is week 8. Dividing simple fraction, full number by fraction, and vice versa. Division of fractions is a simple operation. You will be surprised to know that division of one, one fraction by other fraction is actually a process of multiplication of fractions. After going through with this lesson, you are expected to divide a simple fraction, full number, by a fraction, and vice versa. Learning task 1. Give the lowest term, then write the reciprocal of the following fractions. Number 1, 2 fourths. The GCF is 2, and the lowest term is 1 half. The reciprocal is 2 over 1. Number 2, 6 over 9. The lowest term is 2 thirds. And the reciprocal is 3 halves. Number 3, 10 twelves. The lowest term is 5 sixths. And 6 over 5 is the reciprocal. Number 4, 8 twelves. The lowest term is 2 thirds. And 3 halves is the reciprocal. Number 5, 12 over 32. The lowest term is 3 eighths. And the reciprocal is 8 thirds. Number 6, 27 over 45. The lowest term is 3 pips. And 5 thirds is the reciprocal. Number 7, 37 over 63. The lowest term is 5 ninths. And 9 over 5 is the reciprocal. And number 8, 64 over 96. The lowest term is 2 thirds, and 3 halves is the reciprocal. When dividing a whole number by a fraction, you are finding how many groups of the fraction you can fit in the whole. The standard way of dividing a whole number by a fraction is to multiply the whole number by the reciprocal of the fraction. You can also draw a diagram to help you visualize the process. You need to remember the multiplication or division first before you do addition or subtraction. Example Suppose you are given 10 and 1 half and 3 fourths. You are asked to find the quotient of the two fractions. First, find the reciprocal of the divisor 3 fourths. Now 3 fourths becomes 4 thirds. Next, multiply the dividend 10 and 1 half by the reciprocal 3 fourths. Change words 10 and 1 half to improper fractions, and that is 21 halves. Now multiply 21 halves by 4 thirds. You can use cancellation for 21 and 3 divided by 3. 21 divided by 3, 7. 3 divided by 3, 1. For 2 and 4, you can also use cancellation. Divided by 2. 4 divided by 2 is 2. 2 divided by 2 equals 1. Then multiply 7 times 2, 14, and 1 times 1, 1. Or 14. Learning task 2. Find the quotient. Reduce your answer to lowest term. Number 1, 5 and 1 half. Same as 5 times 2 over 1. 5 times 2 equals 10 over 1 or 10. 
Number 2, 9 divided by 1 third. That is same as 9 times 3 over 1. Equals 27 over 1 or 27. Number 3, 8 divided by 4 fifths. Same as 8 times 5 over 4 equals 40 over 40, 40 over 5 equals 10. Number 4, 12 divided by 2 6. Same as 12 times 6 over 2. 12 times 6 equals 72, then copy denominator 2. 72 divided by 2 equals 36. Number 5, 16 divided by 4 fifths is same as 16 times 5 over 4. 16 times 5 equals 80 over 4. 80 divided by 4 equals 20. To divide the whole number by a fraction, multiply the dividend by the reciprocal of the divisor. In order to find the reciprocal of a fraction, reverse the position of the numerator and the denominator. If the fraction is a mixed number, change the mixed number to an improper fraction first, then get the reciprocal of the given improper fraction. If the numbers to be divided are mixed numbers, change them first to improper fractions before dividing. Learning task 3. Perform the indicated operations. Compare the quotient of its expression. Number 1. 3 pips divided by 1 third is same as 3 pips times 3 over 1. Let's multiply. 3 times 3 and 5 times 1 equals 9 pips. In mixed fraction, this is 1 and 4 pips. While 1 and 1 pip divided by 3 eighths is same as 6 pips times 8 over 3. Let's, let's cancel. 6 and 3. Divide by 2, 3 divided by 2, 3 divided by 3, 1. Then 2 times 8 equals 16 and 5 times 1 equals 5. In mixed fraction, this is 3 and 1 fifth. One and four pips is less than three and one fifth. Number 2, 8 and 5, 7 divided by 1 half is same as change first, a mixed number to improper fraction, and that is 61 over 7 times 2 over 1. 61 times 2 equals 122, and 7 times 1 equals 7. In mixed number, this is 17 and 3 sevenths, while 11 divided by 1 third, 11 times 3 over 1, 11 times 3, 33 over 1 is same as 33, 17 and 3 seven, less than 33. Number 3, 5 and 4 ninths divided by 7 eighths. Change mixed number to improper fraction. For 49 over 9 times reciprocal of 7 eighths, 8 sevenths. Then 49 times 8 equals 392, 9 times 7, 63. In mixed fraction, this is 6 and 14 over 63. While 6 divided by 3 pips, this is 6 times 
5 thirds. You can use cancellation for 6 and 3. Now, let's multiply 2 times 5 equals 10 over 1. The same as 10. 6 and 14 over 63 less than 10. Number 4, 18 and 1 third divided by 3. Change to improper fraction, 55 over 3 times 1 third. 55 times 1, 55 and 3 times 3 equals 9. In mixed fraction, this is 6 and 1 half. While 3 fourths divided by 7 and 8 over 13, 3 fourths times change this first to, to improper fraction. Then reciprocal, 13 over 99. You can cancel, you can use cancellation for 3 and 99. Divided by 3. 1 times 13 equals 13 and 4 times 33 equals 132. 6 and 1, 9. Greater than 13 over 132. Number 5. 10 divided by 2 and 4 fifths. Same as 10 times change first 2 and 4 pips to improper fraction. Then reciprocal. Let's multiply. Cancel first. For 10 and 14 divided by 2. 10 divided by 2 equals 5. 14 divided by 2 equals 7. Let's multiply 5 times 5. Equals 25 over 7. In mixed fraction, this is 3 and 4 sevenths. While 4 and 3 eighths divided by 5 over 32. First, change 4 and 3 eighths to improper fraction. And that is 35 over 8. Times reciprocal of 5 over 32. Then, Use cancellation for 35 and 5 divided by 5. 35 divided by 5, 7. 5 divided by 5 equals 1. For 8 and 32 divided by 8. 32 divided by 8 equals 4. 8 divided by 8 equals 1. 7 times 4 equals 28. 1 times 1 equals 1. Same as 28. 3 and 4 sevenths less than 28. 